are officially the KSPJ girls. I know there's more of us. Jen from the Midday Show. Hello. <laughs> we kicked Joey out of the studio because we're yes. having some girl time right here. And of course, Pam is on the mornings, and we have so many friends during the weekends. I'm Copelia. I do the afternoon show, and that's why we have to kick out Joey because it's KSPJ girl time. Maybe we'll bring his daughter in here someday, Danielle. Yeah. But this week we're focusing on Oklahoma and prayers in the midst of tragedies because. When things happen, you normally ask the questions, why, God? And we don't know. Yeah, and I heard someone saying the other day that if you ever feel like you got God figured out, you're serving the wrong God. And it's true. There's no way that our, you know, it, minds are limited. He's unlimited. So, you know, when things like the tornadoes in Moore, Oklahoma happen, there's no way we can understand why. You know, you can ask a lot of questions, but... Here's what, what I kind of helped me, you know, when you're looking at the images and you see the people standing on the debris that used to be their homes, it's like when you, people say, well, how could God allow this? The enemy is the one that comes to steal, kill, and destroy. It's not God. God is the one who says, I am with the brokenhearted. And he's the one that you see churches and volunteers coming out to be God's hands and feet there. Well, there was a verse that I really like, Proverbs 18.10. It says, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run to it and are safe. And I think instead of trying to figure out why things happen, because we'll never know that, mm -hmm. what do we know? Well, we know that the Bible tells us God is our refuge. We have a lot of encouraging scripture on ksbj.org. If you want to look on there and just pray it and pray it, it's been giving us peace. We've been doing that if you want to join us. We're also going to close in a prayer as well. Definitely. So let's just pray together. Thank you, Lord, that we can run to you and you are our strong tower. You're our refuge and it's in you that we are safe. Thank you. Like our friend Tammy was sharing all the stories of people that you rescued in the midst of the tornadoes in Oklahoma, Father. And we just pray that you would be with the ones that are grieving because of their loss. Um, they lost loved ones and they lost their homes. And we just pray for your comfort and pray for the resources or that are needed to rebuild, to provide homes for those who need it, to provide clothing and food and shelter, that you would be the provider in this situation. We pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Amen.